Hey, what's up, people? Michael here. If you want to partner your YouTube channel up, check out the link in the description. Security was tight at the Monarch Gala. You took quite a risk walking into the lion's den. If we were going to kidnap Dr. Amaral, then we needed to do it from the inside. Beth Wilder. You were quick to trust her. We had common interests. Is that all you had? It's all we needed. Well, I was starting to think seeing a pretty lady like you is too much to hope for. Why don't you keep your mouth shut while we get some privacy before we begin? Okay. How about you get me out of this chair? Ah, ah, ah. Stop squirming. And you're gonna need this. I appreciate it. Sure. What's it look like out there? I think you're secure. Everyone's concentrating on the party. So far, your crazy plan's working. And Dr. Emeril? I don't have a fix on her. She's either at the party or at her office at the R&D facility here on the island. I'll scout out the party. So you're gonna sip champagne while I break into a high security installation. It's like you got this all figured out. I'll save you a cocktail, Weenie. Oh, well, in that case... My cover isn't gonna survive the night, but it'll last a little longer, so you can't walk out the front door with me. This is the quickest way to the R&D facility. I disabled the security at the back door, but there'll be guards. Contact me when you're clear. And Jack, you know what's at stake here. This can't be about revenge. I'm not here for Paul. Hey! He's escaping! will hurt in the morning. My powers were growing. I was learning to control them better. That felt good. <sighs> Who the hell designs these doors? Okay, I'm gonna have to move faster to get through. Hey, Beth, I'm clear. What's next? You'll see a radar tower up ahead soon. Let me know when you get inside. All right. Very sci-fi and very monarch. Something tells me it wasn't commissioned by them, though. You could have warned me about that one, Beth. Okay, how am I getting to that radar tower?
I need to get across somehow. <gasps> Must be a way across. swept under the carpet but now we've got a shitload more bodies to disappear well time felt broken here Cannon felt unstuck in time. The timeline of the old cannon felt loose. I could shift it around. Smart place to aim the cannon, guys. Quicker next time. Smart place to aim the cannon, guys. I've been thinking. Monarch projections say these stutters are getting more frequent. If one hits while we're grabbing Dr. Amaral, he'll be frozen. Yeah, I know. It's a risk. Monarch specialist troopers have the stutterproof gear. I bet Dr. Amaral would have that in her office, too. Yeah. I'll keep an eye out. See if I can grab it for you. Somebody said it's because they both got. Shit! Thanks, Beth. 
need to get to the radar tower. Great, another one. Next stop, the radar tower. Beth, I'm at the radar tower. Where's the lab? Below your feet. It's all top secret. The elevator inside will take you down. Oh, seriously? What is this, a Bond villain layer? You have no idea. Just don't fall into the shark tank. Fuck. Unfortunately, Mr. Serene is preoccupied with as many duties necessary to assure we maintain control over our path forward. And that's what tonight is about. The future. We all knew this day was coming, even if many of you out there aren't sure what it means. We're entering a new phase in our operation. One that presents new risks and new demands. One that requires this. The Cronon Field Regulator, or CFR. Now, many of you know that this device has been the source of our Cronon research since 2010. But what only a select few of you know is that this device is at the center of Monarch's plans to navigate through the dangers of the future. This device... Everybody get down! Oh, Jesus. What the hell's that about? Hey, Beth. I'm headed down into the labs. Okay. A bit of confusion here at the party. Serene's right-hand man's on stage. It was supposed to be Serene. Yeah. I think Paul was too busy trying to have a heart-to-heart -heart with me to make it.
Dr. Amaral's office. Looks like that's one level up. The device drained my powers. We refer to it as a chronon dampener. visited me in that cell, he said time was a closed loop. I believed the fracture couldn't be fixed. Seeing the scale of that facility made me wonder. Time was ending? What was it all for? The chart showed that all of Monarch's major technological advancements started in 2010 around the same time that something else happened. Ground Zero. Dr. Amaral's office. Looks like that's one level up.
might be able to get out from here. Nobody here knows about the mess I made on the way in. <sighs> nice job, Beth. office. The Admiral had tried to warn Paul. The end of time was approaching quickly, less than 24 hours away. Mr. Serene believed it would take years to run its course. Admittedly, he was wrong. That there looks like what Beth wanted. Quite expensive piece of tech you stole. Bill me. I knew Beth's cover wouldn't last long. Had to get it to her at the party before it was too late. Guns made to operate in a stutter. Paul had clear priorities. When time ends, guns don't. The Monarch combat gear was unwieldy. What I'd taken for Dr. Amaral's office was, uh, is much lighter. Almost like a civilian model.
All I had to do was make it through the garage. Seems simple enough. easier. There's gotta be a way out of here. Huh. Oh, shit. Okay. I'm talking about. Beth, I got that device for you, but Dr. Amaral's at the party. Yeah, I just spotted her. Want to be my date? Yeah, save me that cocktail, Weenie. I'll make my way there. They say Hash getting shot at was an insider job. Might create a window for us, but Serena's looking for you. Remember what we said. Ben, I've got company. Let's Go see the party. Great. Right. Right. That's the last of them. Actual is moving in to intercept. 
Guard 5. Spotted entering the tunnel system outside the party grounds. Beth? Huh. Again. I could see the mansion where the gala was. I had to find a way to get there. I could see the energy field of another monarch chrono dam. It would drain my powers. I'd have to find a way to shut it off. My powers won't work within that sphere. I better be careful. Security's tight. Maybe you want to shut that machine off. We're headed for the party. What was your plan? I needed to get to Dr. Amaral before the stutter ended and Monarch found out I was coming. This is, this the, is only the only tunnel entrance, entrance Joyce, Joyce could have entered through. Enter through. Secure, Secure the, the exit. exit. I'm going in alone. Sir, sir, sure you don't, sure want, you don't support? want support? We've seen, We've what, seen what Jack, Jack can, do. can do. I'm the only, the only one who can stop him. stop him. If he gets to the mainland, he'll lose him for good. For Secure, good. Secure the exit. exit. Should be here somewhere. Need to get to her before the stutter ends. Sir, Sir just, just. I know he I explained know he this to me, to me but, but let me just let confirm. Me just confirm. Mr. Mr. Hatch really wants me, wants me to shoot you. Uh, he, wants he wants you to shoot, to shoot at, at him. him. And he wants, and he it, wants to it to be convincing. Your exit, your exit is, is as, as we've discussed. discussed. Get to your position, blend, blend in. in. They'll, think, They'll you're think you're responding to what just went down. down. The blind spot, the blind spot you'll, you'll need has been prearranged. Pre 
I know the plan. I just, I just don't get it. Get it. You don't have, you don't to, have get to get it. it. You just you have just to do have it to do and it keep and your keep mouth your shut. shut. This, this is, is way above, above your pay grade, son. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. He arranged his own assassination. What the fuck? A traitor fired shots during Mr. Hatch's speech. I assume this was Beth Wilder. We both know it wasn't. Hatch wanted to send Monarch into a state of disarray. Best way to avoid blame? Look like the target. Once we grab her. There's a boat dock right outside the mansion. Okay, we can make that work. back in and that drone turns us into paste. Are gonna think of, you 
Need to open that gate. That gate's still closed. What's up? What about you? You're clear. Go. I can swing by go. and... No. Just go. We went to all this trouble to grab her. Beth. I'm counting on you to keep her alive. I'll make my own way out. My plan was simple. There's a bridge to the mainland. I'd fight my way through anything Monarch would throw at me and then steal a car, drive it back to the swimming pool. Just remember, we need your ass alive for the next part. We'll see how it shakes out.
with Beth and Dr. Emmer all clear, it was time for me to get gone. For that, I need wheels. Valley parking. Beloved by car thieves everywhere. This thing growing inside me. I've been fighting it for six hard years. Dr. Amaral was developing a cure for the Cronon Syndrome. She was the only one who could administer the treatments that kept my sickness at bay. Paul? And Jack had taken her away from me. Martin, how is it possible he managed to take her? Paul, is your illness talking? I'm on your side. Easy, you're... They took her. Without Sophia, there's no chance of a cure. We did all we could. But there are forces within Monarch working against you, and I believe Burke was just the tip of the iceberg. It wasn't just Joyce that did this. Uh, sir? Uh, we've recovered Dr. Amaral's laptop. We have it set up over there if you want to take a look. I'll be right there. I want to go over Sophia's figures. If she's right, the fracture is escalating a lot faster than we anticipated. You know the future. Dr. Emerald doesn't. Is the lifeboat even in a viable state for activation? She's trying to convince you the schedule's wrong. Why? To get you to rush this? To make a mistake? The people opposing you. She could be one of them. She isn't. Are you willing to bet the entire plan on that? I implore you, hold off on activation, Paul. Let me clean house before this gets completely out of hand. I should have been here. Somebody made a false report, sent me to the tunnels to divert my attention. Like I said, people working against you. How do you want to proceed? I saw the footage of your speech. They tried to get to you. I warned you we were compromised. There are people on the inside who want us to fail. Just be glad they're a lousy shot. Yeah, they were. Somebody was working against me. Somebody close. Martin Hatch. Sophia Amaral. I could only trust one of them. I want him apprehended. Immediately. Sir, I have some information about Martin Hatch. Martin had been my closest advisor for years. I began to wonder if that had been a mistake. Sophia's loyal. 
She's always been loyal. I don't think we can trust her. The way she looked at the countermeasure like she's seen it before. She knows what it does. Sophia's research had saved my life. Loyalty doesn't run any deeper. Sophia's data has always been good. I'll trust her judgment. We need to analyze these figures and make final preparations to activate the lifeboat protocol at once. Fine. I'll take the laptop to the science department. No, I think I'll do that myself. I see. Sir? Put people on Mr. Hatch. I want constant eyes on him. Yes, sir. You got it. We pulled some images from the security cameras. We've identified Joyce's accomplice. She's Beth Wilder, one of our mid-level operatives. Her. My God, she's been with us all along. She's working with Jack. Where is she now? Unknown. But we've got a kill team tracking her. No, 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 no. She can't be killed. Not yet. Find her. And whatever Mr. Hatch does, I want to know about it. Don't screw this up. Beth Wilder. It was the first time I'd heard her name. But she had been there in the past. When it all started. She'd been there the whole time, working against me from the inside. And she wasn't the only one. The treatments, they're losing their effectiveness. There's no changing the inevitable. Time is just one closed loop. And no matter what I do, time ends. I need to get in that lab. There's something in there that I need. The lifeboat protocol. What is it that you're so threatened by, Martin? Do I look threatened to you? This is Dr. Amaral's report. The stutters, they're, they're increasing in frequency. What is that? A chronon disrupted life form. Extremely hostile. It's Dr. Kim. Let's go! Let's go! No, 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 And what did Burke want with it? Well, I don't know. I don't even know what the lifeboat protocol is. It's a sanctuary. 
designed to shelter a list of Marduk's essential personnel to weather the storm until they can develop a solution. Essential personnel? So that means that I'd be on that list, right? Not under Paul Serene's lead, you wouldn't. He's failed to see the value in his own people, too consumed with grand ideals and delusions. You know what I find to be the most terrifying notion on this planet? The idea of God. Simply the idea. A being with that much power. The ability to take and give so freely. That kind of control. But you'd be feared, not worshipped. Yet, people believe in it just as people believe in Paul Serene. You see, what's so scary about God isn't his control, but rather if he ever lost it. Paul Serene's become unhinged, Charlie. He's triggered a catastrophe. He has the chance to fix it, but he's choosing not to. He's choosing to let things end. The end of time. And this is where we come in. We risk too much leaving the keys to the kingdom in one man's hands. We need insurance. There's something called the CFR. It's a crucial key to our survival and must remain safe. But as long as Paul is the only one with access to it, it isn't. With access to the CFR, I would take over. Get Monarch back on track, and once I do, restructuring would be in order, Charlie. Restructuring that would see you as my right hand. I'd be on the list. Absolutely. Then I need to go back to Monarch. And that sort of privilege isolation, it can only be done from the inside. Put the island on lockdown, but the pump house on the west side has an old supply tunnel that runs beneath the bay. No one knows about it. You'll go unseen. Time is of the essence, Charlie. You better get to it. Yeah. Commander Davis. Yes, sir. Head to the perimeter lab. We're moving forward. The frequency of the stutters is still unpredictable, but they're persistent. Erratic, but persistent. I need certainty. If I initiate the protocol, there's no going back. Mr. Serene, something like this. There is no certainty. We've never dealt with it before. How long? We've been running Dr. Amaral's simulations. It's hard to say without her to confirm, but... Just give me a time. The Joyceville could collapse within eight hours. <sighs> Mr. Suri, if you're going to proceed, now would be the time to decide. <laughs> Time's ending, just like you said. And the lifeboat protocol, it's a place 
They built it to protect people from the fracture. And the only problem is, is, is there's a list and anyone who's not on it is pretty much fucked. But if we make it back to the mainland, I, I can get us on the list. All of this entire island is on lockdown. How are we gonna do that, Charlie? There's a tunnel. Hey, Ryan, if you are lying to me this time, I swear to God. No, get off! Tired as shit. I don't know why you're doing this, but I don't have to put your name on shit, motherfucker. What'd you do to him? He's fine. I'm gonna tell you why you're gonna put me on that list. I got a pregnant wife at home, and she's the only thing that I am thinking about right now. So if you get in the way of me protecting her, I swear to fucking God, next time, you will not catch your breath. Lead the way. Out, Mr. Hatch. Yes. I've come to free you, my friend. Imprisonment. It's unsettling. It's time for you to rejoin the others. To return to the infinite.
You okay? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm good. We need to get... Get on the fucking ground! Hey, ground! No, 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 we're with Monarch! What don't you hey, understand? No, get on the ground! Hey, no, no, no. Hey, I'm the one that called it in. I'm Hatch's guy. Wincott? Yeah. Who's she? She's... Cronon scientist. She's important. We have to get her back to Monarch right away. Please. Get the fuck out of here. Bell! Yeah. Gibson, I got for her. Fiona! Fiona! Fiona, you gotta listen to me. Hey! Ah. Oh, shit! You killed him! Fuck! Hey! I didn't know that they were gonna kill him. What was I supposed to do? Huh? You let me on and then you kidnapped Isn't me. Isn't about you, Charlie! Are you stealing this car? Just get the fuck out of here. No, you're gonna need me. I got what I needed out of you. Yeah, I'm getting used to it. Why don't you open your eyes? The world is about to end. I'm trying to do something. Yeah, you're a real hero. Fuck you. Huh? I'll see you there. Burke. You fuck. <sighs> you know, I'm really gonna enjoy killing your wife. Commander Davis? Davis and his team. They're all good men. Monarch's finest. Paul. Paul. What about my treatments? I'm afraid so. You know what this means. You don't know for sure. I'm a dead man! You let this happen! Jack, he wants me to become you. He wants me to suffer until the end. Joyce and Wilder. But what was troubling me is who got them in the Kim's lab. She paid a visit while she was thought to be missing, minutes before the explosion. Paul. Paul, will you... Paul, will you listen to me? Look, it's time you see her for who she really is. This was a part of gift. They forced her. She's trying to destroy you. She's Paul. trying to help me. Oh, Jesus. Look at you. 
the smartest man I know, blinded by a fool's love. Paul, what are you planning on? Sophia's loyal. She's gotten inside your head. She's always been loyal. You need to think about if this. If the fracture's happening now, I owe this to her. I need to wake my family. I'm afraid we have no time. you could make it. I was just telling your girl here how concerned about you we've been. Emily, we need to go. Go? What's the rush? Emily, let's go. Emily, give me the keys. Give me the keys, Emily. Emily, listen. 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 Please, please, please. This is not who I am. This is not. I'm telling you, I never felt good doing this. I, I never, I never felt good. 
doing this. It was the only thing I knew how to do. And when I got back, I couldn't, I couldn't find anything. I couldn't find anything to do. And Monarch, they found that useful, and they put me to work. And I swear to God, I couldn't, I couldn't stand, I couldn't stand being alone. And so, so every Tuesdays and Wednesdays, I would, I would walk down the street because it was the only two nights at the bartender. And she wasn't at school. And I told myself every night to ask you what. It took me a fucking year. And like, if Monarch, if they gave me structure, you gave me purpose. I did this to protect you. I did this to protect You have to listen to me. Something terrible is coming. And I will explain to you on the way, but we have to move. We have to move right now. If you will just let me, if you will just let me protect you on my side. It's Beers. I'm at the perimeter lab. So I have some information about Martin Hatch. I want him apprehended. Immediately. 